Thanks for your interest in keeping your projectors clean and running like new. In this episode, we will walk you through steps on how to safely and properly clean your projector filter housing and case surface. To properly clean your projector filter housing and surface, we will be using a dust-off duster and office surface disinfecting wipes. Before we begin, turn off power to your projector. Make sure you let it cool for at least 20 minutes prior to opening and cleaning. Before cleaning your projector for the first time, you should try to set aside time to read through the operating manual in detail. This can help to inform you of how to correctly operate your projector. In addition, operating manuals often provide useful maintenance tips specific to your projector model. For example, how to remove your projector's filter cover. Even if you have previous experience operating projectors, each model has their own unique quirks and features that are important to be aware of. Becoming familiar with these features will allow you to tell when something is wrong, or even better, to take preventative measures to stop things from going wrong in the first place. The reason that you want to clean the projector's filter is to keep the proper airflow. LCD, DLP, and LCOS digital projectors produce large amounts of heat during their operation. This heat must be channeled away from the projector to prevent overheating and projector malfunction. It is especially important for the life of the projector lamp that this heat is removed effectively since projector overheating is the primary cause of projector lamp failure. As a consequence, all projectors have filters, which is inevitably where all of the dust particles removed from the air end up. To ensure that these filters keep performing well, they must be maintained regularly. This is very important since damage to the projector caused by dirty filters may not be covered by the projector warranty. How often you clean your projector's filters will depend on the environment in which the projector filters are working. An environment that has minimal dust will mean that the filters will not need to be cleaned as often as an environment with lots of dust, such as in a classroom, where chalk dust can be a problem. Generally, projector manuals recommend that cleaning the filters once every 100 to 300 hours is usually acceptable. But you should check your projector's manual to find out what the recommended filter cleaning cycle specific to your projector is. Remember that you should also clean and replace your filters whenever you notice an excessive buildup of dust. First, let's understand how to properly use a duster. Do not shake. Do not tilt the can at a steep angle. Do not use upside down, causing liquid propellant to be discharged. And you also want to use short bursts. Remember to keep out dust and dirt during the filter replacement process by covering the projector and its openings with a cloth while you remove the dust from the filter. Insert the extension tube into the duster nozzle. After removing the projector cover and taking out the filter, apply short bursts with the duster to blow away dust from the filter. Before you reinsert the clean filter and close the cover, make sure that you also remove all the dust and dirt possible from the projector cabinet, the area where the filters are inserted into, by using the same duster to blow the dust out. Place the filter back into the projector and follow your manual to reassemble the projector cover. By effectively cleaning the filter, proper airflow will make sure your projector is kept cool while operating. Finally, the projector case is an important piece that usually could use cleaning if you take the projector on the road or if it is moved throughout your office. To clean the case, use a disinfecting wipe to remove grime buildup. Use a wipe to rub down the case of the projector, removing grime and germs from the entire shell. Remember, to properly disinfect the surface, allow the disinfecting wipe solution to sit for a few minutes to aid in destroying any bacteria. We hope you learned how to properly clean your projector and picked up some cleaning tips along the way.